Located in the north of central part of Vietnam, apart from Hanoi just two hours by car, and Ho Chi Minh City for one hour and 40 minutes by air. Thay Hoa Province is the one with an area of 11,000 square kilometers, the fifth rank in Vietnam, and a population of 3.7 million, the third rank in the country, in which there are 2.6 million of laboring aged people, with 70% of the skillful laborers. Thanh Hoa is currently one of the leading provinces in Vietnam in FGI investment. The average annual GRDP growth rate is among the top in the country. Thanh Hoa has been repeatedly changing to become a new growth pearl together with Hanoi, Haiphong and Quang Ninh, forming a development quadrilateral in the northwest part, an economy, culture and social center of Vietnam. Thanh Hoa's terrain spreads across three regions, mountainous midland, plain and coastal creating favorable conditions for the development of diverse types of industrial, agricultural, service economies, and especially tourism. With all types of transportation including road, railway, waterway, and airway, Tainghua has all the conditions to become the center of economic and traffic connection with other provinces and cities of Vietnam, as soon as the area and the world. Based on the infrastructure system, such as the National Motorway No. 1, the North South Highway, Ho Chi Minh Highway, Tosun Airport, Nissan Deep Sea Harbor, Chas Asia Route, and Vietnam Laos Border. At present, Thanh Hoa has one economic zone, 19 industrial zones, and 144 industrial complexes were planned and constructed in the location of the province being so convenient in terms of transportation, perfectly technical infrastructure to meet the diversifying demands of businesses and investors, such as inner outer transportation, national grid electric city, providing and training water and processing wastewater, waste material systems, and the service systems of finance, banking, telecommunications. Nissan Economic Zone, one of the eight key coastal economic zones in Vietnam, is receiving the highest investment incentives. Now there are enterprises belonging to the 200 world top operating there, such as Idemisu Kazan Group, Marubani Corporation, Misu Chemicals, Taheyo Cement Corporation Japan, Korean Capco Group, SK Engineering and Construction Korea, Kuwait Petroleum International, Kuwait, Museum Mass Group, Singapore, Many other factories on national and international scale have been working there. Nissan Petrochemical Refinery, 10 million tons of crude oil per year. Nissan Thermal Power Plant No. 1, 300 megawatts. Nissan Thermal Power Plant No. 2, 102,000 megawatts. Three cement factories with other capacity of 20 million tons annually, for instance. Industrial zones and industrial clusters located in almost all localities in the province. Invested infrastructure, convenient transportation, convenient for the operations of many times of businesses, including small and medium enterprises, businesses using raw materials and human resources in rural areas. Taiwan is a land of rich historical values, a cradle of Dongsan culture, a brilliant pinnacle of ancient Vietnamese civilization. This is also a place where many feudal dynasties of Vietnam were founded. Currently, Taiwan has one world cultural heritage, five special national relics, and hundreds of other nationally ranked relics. This is a great potential for Taiwan to attract investment in developing cultural and spiritual tourism. With 102 kilometer long coastline and territorial water of 17,000 square kilometers, associated with white sand beaches, Taiwan's many beautiful beaches, convenient for developing the marine economy, especially the tourism industry, including Sâm Sơn and Hai Tiến, Hai Hoa, Tiên Trang, Bãi Đông. Plus, by nature, Taiwan has many unique landscapes and landscapes with pristine beauty that have been invested by large Vietnamese businesses to become unique tourism destinations, creating attraction for domestic and international tourists. Taiwan province applies preferential mechanisms and policies 
to support investment according to the principle investors enjoy the highest level of incentives in terms of benefits and fulfill their obligations at the lowest level within the regulatory framework. In particular, in addition to fully apply the central preferential policies on land rent and water surface rent, corporation income tax, export tax, and incentives for investment projects in agriculture and rural areas, Tinghua Province promulgates separate policies for investors in nature field. Currently, Tenghua has 11 projects by investors from European countries and joint ventures being implemented with a total investment of over 311 million US dollars. The fields include gamen, shoe processing, sports equipment, agricultural product processing, electricity generation, and investment in industrial cluster infrastructure. In recent years, Tenghua province export turnover to European markets has already been at a high level. In 2022, export turnover reached nearly 615 million US dollars, accounting for 13.3 percent of the province's total export turnover. In the first nine months of 2023, export turnover to European market reached over 400 million US dollars. The main export products are garments, leather shoes, frozen clams, canned food, backpacks, bags. Tenghua Province calls on enterprises from European countries to invest in key areas, including processing and manufacturing industry, prioritized investment and development attraction in the fields of refinery and petrochemical industry, energy, food processing, manufacturing and assembling electronic components, electric vehicles, auto parts, medical equipment production, biotechnology products, pharmaceuticals, plastic production, kneading, garment. Tourism industry focus on attracting investment in marine resort tourism, heritage tourism, ecotourism, and spiritual tourism, high-quality tourism services, and high-end entertainment centers. Agricultural sector priority is given to attract investment in large-scale concentrated agricultural production, developing quality and safe livestock farms, application of modern scientific and technological advances in aquaculture and offshore fishing, development of lost wood material areas associated with construction of processing factories. Healthcare sector Tenghua Province also calls for investment in projects on non-public hospitals, especially in the form of joint venture investment or public-private partnerships with available public hospitals, increasing attraction of investment in research and development of production and manufacturing of high-tech medical equipment. In the fields of urban and infrastructure development, Tenghua prioritized investment attraction in projects of upgrading road and seaport systems, connecting and upgrading airports, water supply plants, water treatment plants, and hydroelectric plants. Tenghua Province wishes to consolidate and tighten the relationship and trust between Tenghua and its partners and investors, thereby enhancing cooperation for mutual development. <laughs>